Hey everybody, Jay Super Awesome here. I'd like to welcome you all back to my channel. In this video, I will be showing my recent Scream Factory pickups. First up, I got the Alligator 4K set. This is a three disc set. I've always been a pretty big fan of this movie. It's been a long time since I've seen it, but it is a childhood favorite of mine. Pretty nice release. Then, of course, I had to get Alligator 2, The Mutation. Not really sure why they chose to release one on Blu-ray and one on 4K, but it is what it is, I guess. Um, Alligator 2, The Mutation. It erupted from the bowels of the city in a lethal frenzy. I don't remember as much about this one, but I do remember enjoying it. So I'm looking forward to checking this one out again. Next up, I got the 80s classic, Alone in the Dark. This one came with a slip cover. I've always really enjoyed this one. This one has a fantastic cast. It has Jack Palance, Donald Pleasant, and Martin Landau. So that one's Alone in the Dark. Next up is Night Creatures. Now, I have never seen this one, um, but it looked really cool. I did watch the trailer for it. Uh, pretty much anything that's released by Hammer or that has Peter Cushion in it, uh, I will definitely give it a try. And that cover art is fantastic. Next up, we got Hercules starring Lou Ferrigno. Lou Ferrigno is the strongest man on earth. The strongest man on earth in a super adventure odyssey. I think anytime you add super with anything, it just makes it better. So that's Hercules. I think these were going out of print, actually. Next up, we have The Adventures of Hercules, Hercules 2, also starring Lou Ferrigno. Lou Ferrigno returns to battle the forces of evil. From a mythic world beyond your imagination, Hercules returns. Beyond my imagination, huh? I don't know, I can imagine a lot, but definitely looking forward to checking these out. I actually haven't ever seen those. Next up, we have Meat Cleaver Massacre. Haven't seen this one. Four crazed killers butchered his wife, son, and daughter from his hospital deathbed. He called upon the powers of the occult for revenge, and he got it. He really got it. And I was really surprised to find out this one actually has Christopher Lee in it. So just like Peter Cushion, anything with Christopher Lee in it, I believe is worth checking out. That one is Meat Cleaver Massacre. Next up, I got... Watchers 2. And I was really hoping they would do a complete box set of this series. This is a fantastic series. This one stars Mark Singer, uh, the Beastmaster himself. And it also stars Tracy Stoggins and, and pretty much anything that she's ever been in, she's great. But Watchers 2, definitely looking forward to checking that one out. Uh, like I said, it would be great if they would release all of these movies again, so... They definitely need a wider audience. And the last two I got were just DVDs. The first one is The Ice Demon. The Chill of Evil Comes Home. I've watched this one already. It's a little bit of a slow burn. I thought it was okay. And then last up for this video on the third day, Hell is Coming. I actually haven't seen this one yet. Thought it looked pretty cool. And that's going to do it for this video. Please like, subscribe, comment below. Let me know what you think about my pickups. And as always, I would like to thank you all for watching. 